Hi friends, Sparkled here. I'm gonna make a fun introduction to the Hotel del Coronado. I just can't live without you. <laughs> We're at the Hotel del Coronado and uh, this construction was built by uh, the Chinese with no nails, all wooden dowels. And uh, the hotel is famous for a movie being shot here called Some Like a Hot with Marilyn Monroe, Tony Curtis, and Jack Lemmon. That's it. <laughs> Hello, welcome to Gibson Games. I see you coming in. Please grab a bandana and find the clipboard that aligns with your color. Yes, welcome. Built in 1888, the Hotel del Coronada is one of the last surviving wooden Victorian beach resorts in the world. It's also the second largest such structure in the United States. It's pretty close to being the last of its kind. moments in these chairs. <laughs> they used to be in a better place across the uh, atrium here on the other side. I guess uh, too many people were doing the naughty naughty in the dark so they moved the chairs. So. <laughs> Where's my queen? Oh, Karadeva. <laughs> the queen must be beside the king. And the it's king nice must be obey the orders of the queen. <laughs> People think men create the wars, but it's actually the women behind the men that create the wars. Yeah, I'm a queen and he's just... A king. What? <laughs> Kings follow the orders of the queen. Good. <laughs> Some claim the Dell is haunted. One of these spirits is believed to be Kate Morgan, who came to the hotel for Thanksgiving in 1892. She took her own life nearly a week later, and it's said her spirit still wanders here. Kate Morgan died under the mysterious circumstances and is said by locals to know haunt the Hotel del Coronado. Many believe that Kate Morgan's ghost still resides in her old room. Guests staying in the room 302 have reported all sorts of paranormal phenomena. As you see, this is a very pleasant place to be during the daytime. You can find different activities that suit your current mood. Let's go and see what happens here at night. Lots of lights here now. Do you know? that the hotel was the first commercial building lit by electricity. Thomas Edison came to the Hotel del Coronado shortly before it opened to oversee the installation of electric lighting. The Dell became the first commercial structure 
to be illuminated by electricity. If you are sitting at your computer right now and watching my video, consider getting up and going to a party tonight. Dance, be active and stay healthy. Like and subscribe to my channel. Your Sparkler.